What we'll do, start to do is go through the principles. So the idea is, if I, in throwing this ball, if I, if I can do it properly, what will happen is I'll take it back, throw it, it'll basically go to the wall with, without very much spin and come right back to me. Now how do I do that on a regular basis? Um, what, what we're trying to address is one of the harder skills in, in golf. Matching up the vertical arm swing with the horizontal rotation of the body, right? So when we're trying to do that, what I, what I figured out when I wrote the book, I wrote all the lessons down that I taught and it didn't make a whole lot of sense. So we had to start to figure out, well, what are the principles that we're trying to teach? Consistent messages that's coming through on all the, uh, the lessons. And one of them was midline. Like keeping the, people talk about keeping the club in front of you and that's sort of what we're talking about here. So if you're standing, if I, if I hold the ball neut neutral, my hands neutral on my midline, I'm in a strong position. So yeah, so on your midline. So it's, this is the same position, like if you're going to pass a baby, Mark's got a two and a four year old. So, but if you're going to pass me a kid on this side, go ahead and just pass, pass a kid to me. Yeah, I mean, you're going to have your arms underneath the armpits, the head's going to be level, nobody's going to pass a kid like this, right? They're heavy, but it's, that's normal to pass somebody a baby like that. Your weight comes on to this side, it's in the middle of your chest. Now, even if it's a, if it's a light, a, a child that doesn't weigh too much, and you take them off center, you're not as strong. If you try to resist me here with it in the middle of your body, that's fairly strong. If I move you six to eight inches off, there's nowhere near the stability, right? So that's the first idea, is I'm strong and balanced with my hands on my, neutral on my 